We want to find the limit as x approaches 2 of this rational function without using L'Hopital's rule. So let's factor out the denominator first. x squared plus x minus 6 factors into x plus 3 times x minus 2. And now we can break this up into two separate limits. The first limit is going to have 1 over x plus 3. The second limit will have everything else. Now, if I plug in x equals 2 in for 1 over x plus 3, I get 1 fifth. And that multiplies the limit. The second thing we're going to do now is we use the property of logs. So whenever you have ln of a minus ln of b, that's just ln of a over b. So in this case, we get ln of x plus 3 over 2x plus 1. And now I'm just using the fact that ln of x is the same thing as a times a over ln of x, since the a's cancel. And then this a in the denominator is going to come up here as the exponent of x. And that's using this property, ln of x to the n is equal to n ln of x. So we want to use this fact, and we're going to have ln of x plus 3, 2x plus 1 over here. And then we're going to come up with a new a here. So I'm letting a equal x plus 3 over 2x plus 1 minus 1. And so th this is a right here, and this is 1 over a. Okay, so by this property, it's equivalent to the previous limit. Okay, now I can break up x plus 3 over 2x plus 1 as 1 half plus 5 over 2 times the quantity 2x plus 1. And here I skip the steps, but basically you would just use long division. You would put x plus 3 in and then 2x plus 1 outside here and just do long division to get this result. Now I can separate this into two separate limits. The first limit will be basically this right here, the x plus 3 over 2x plus 1 minus 1 over x minus 2. And the second limit will be the rest. Now I'm going to break this up. First, I'm going to worry about the first limit. And so in order to solve this limit, I'm going to get a common denominator. Simplify. We have negative x plus 2 over 2x plus 1 as a numerator. That's going to be all over x minus 2. And now I can factor out a negative from the top. And then you basically multiply everything by negative 1. So negative x becomes x. 2 becomes negative 2. Everything else stays the same. The x minus 2 is canceled. We're left with 1 over 2x plus 1. And so the limit there is negative 1 fifth. So recall we broke this up into two separate limits. We found out that this was negative 1 fifth just now. So all we have to do is worry about the third or the second limit. Now for this limit, I can factor out the natural log. So taking the limit of the natural log is the same thing as taking the natural log of the limit. And unfortunately here, I, I didn't show the work, but basically this is similar to the limit as x approaches infinity of 1 plus 1 over x to the x power. And here's a typo. This should be 1 over x plus 3 over 2x plus 1 minus 1. So it's the same exponent here. Um, because basically it's just like, you know, one to infinity. It's very similar. And so this we know is E. So this whole thing is E basically. And we have ln of E, which is just one. So now putting this together, we said this was negative one fifth. This was one. And so one fifth times negative one fifth times one is negative 1 over 25 and that is my limit.